Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and welcome back to Automobilista for another race in the Porsche Carrera Cup. Today it is race two of two this weekend at what is our sort of recreation of the Sydney Super Night or whatever it's called in the Virgin Australia Supercars Championship. So race one was probably the biggest fail of all time when it comes to my races on Automobilista so far. We are qualified seventh, not quite on the pace like what we were at Townsville but we did manage to get up to fourth before I went and binned it at turn one in what was a, probably the fastest spin I've ever had on all the this week to be fair. Uh, so that meant that we ruined our tyres and we're now starting from the dead last so a lot of work to do. Now as you can see the sun is pretty low on the track and I do apologise if this is creating some uh, graphics issues or frame rate issues. The stutters at the start will probably be a little bit bad, but they'll get better as the race goes on and the cars spread out. I just hope we can get a decent start and move up through the field, because right now, this is not a fun place to be. But, as I said in my previous video, in what was race one, there is so many different lines you can run around this track, and it really is a set-up track, you know. A driver can do only so much here, in my opinion. There's so many sort of mid-corner, like or mid-speed as I call them. I mean, you have low speed and fast speed corners. These are sort of somewhere in the middle that require a lot of side bite and a lot of uh, grip to be able to, well, carry more mid-corner speed fundamentally than everyone else. So it's really one of those hard tracks that you have to get right as soon as you roll the car off the truck in real life. Here on the game, thankfully, we can just sort of go in and out of the garage as quick as we want and make changes. But having said that, I only did a 20 minute practice session so I sort of threw this setup together nice and quick and the car is it was god awful it's way better than what it was but still way far off what I want it to be it's just it was so tight that I had to loosen it up but the problem is since I've loosened it up it seems to wear its rears very quickly that's why I'm not going to help the leather on this warm-up lap see that in front of the field there's only 20 cars in this race well I say only 20 that <laughs> in the modern day is quite a lot of cars but as you can see they're already starting to form up so we've got a long way to go if we want to get anywhere near the front Alright, so just waiting for the AI take five years to warm up, warm up on this game for some reason. Alright, so there we go. Rear tyres are good, hopefully we can get a decent start, get a couple. Now the start finish line here is downhill, so I'm going to sort of throttle up at the last minute so I don't roll down the hill. Alright, that, that went a lot quicker than what I thought it was going to. Jesus, the frame rate is not nice. Start. Up into 14, so we gained six spots already. And the last corner is where I'm the slowest on this track. The second corner is where we're the fastest, so I think 
maybe we can make a move going into there if I can just get turn one right and not wad it up like what we did yesterday. Oh, big move. Just send it. This is 16 laps, so it's a long way. We've got plenty of time to make up some uh, positions. Just don't want to let the leaders get too far away early. that last corner to save my life. Ooh, talk about a slide job, far out. <laughs> Did not plan on doing that, that was simply just breaking too late. Wow, alright. That was decent. You might have seen the replay of that later on, holy crap.
don't have the pace. Overheat those rears now. That's track limits? Yeah. All right. On. Oh, what the fuck? Oh no, what the hell? You're... Oh my god. Wow, we are officially dead. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> wow, okay, that was weird. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow, we are actually destroyed. And so is he. <laughs> what on earth just happened? Oh my god, I'm going to have to look at the replay of that one. Oh, wow, okay. I just, I really don't understand what just happened. Like, we... I got loose here. I was definitely burning off the rears and overheating them, but I don't know why it snapped loose on me. Oh, that was really weird. Double DNF. Wow. I haven't had that. Well, I haven't had one of those all year. I've had DNFs, but not two of them. Because we're going so well, I don't know why the rears just let go on me. I mean, I just had no rear grip all of a sudden. It's like just fell off a cliff. Ran slightly wide through there, but it may have been the dirt on the tyres. I have no idea. Like lose there, but then I tried to power out of this corner like I have been all day, and it just got loose and just absolutely got sent, and then boom! <laughs> wow, 
Wow, that was a big one. Ouch. Well, that's all she wrote. Sorry, guys, for another disappointing episode, but thanks, guys, for tuning in. And, uh, yeah, stay tuned for the V8s, where hopefully we can just finish the damn race. I mean, far out. What a horrible start to a weekend. It is going to be under lights, so it's going to be a lot of fun. But, yeah, no, that is not what we wanted. All right, guys, until next time, I'll catch you later.